Hi, my name is Lars Kunas. I am one of the founders of NanoQ, uh, a, a company that focuses on working with nanotechnology structures. Uh, we're trying to improve um, certain aspects in city development and city maintenance. Uh, one of our products is definitely a, a complete 360 graffiti solution, anti-graffiti solution. Uh, what we try to do is we remove it uh, with very less amount, uh, very little amount of water, so uh, so that we try to be resource friendly. And once we have removed it with very little amount of resources, we can actually co coat the walls, and so we don't need to have any cleaners whatsoever anymore. Uh, what we do is we basically put uh, like living skin on the wall, which you just can. Um, get off with water once the graffiti has been top put on. So um, it literally takes just 20% of the amount of water necessary usually to remove graffiti. Nano means actually trying to manipulate surfaces uh, on the nano scale, on the very, very small stage. Um, lots of uh, materials and surfaces have their actually properties within the nano scale. And once you um, change and manipulate these surface structures, you can achieve amazing results and amazing um, um, function, functionalities of these surfaces. The overall idea is to yeah, just show what what can be done with materials that are all around us, but um, are just um, yeah, taken as the materials as they are. And what we try to do is more or less rethink these materials and what can they do for us in a, in a more sustainable way. I think everybody has ideas, but uh, the younger generation has um, grown with this lots of inputs from the internet or whatsoever. So um, I think there are lots of interesting approaches to, to existing problems or to maybe problems that will, will arise in the future. It can be very bothersome to, to get to the right people. So um, I think in our nowadays lots of people have great ideas that have uh, can have great impacts in our everyday lives. Um, but there are very little opportunities or very little mechanisms in the whole organizational structure of today um, that where people can actually put these ideas forward and um, be heard.